Hi and welcome back. So if you didn't know that yet, I'm here to make you smell amazing. And one way to smell amazing is to wear a spicy fragrance. Spicy fragrances are great. They can be sexy, they can be attractive and seductive. And if you don't have a spicy fragrance in your collection yet, I really think you need to go out and get one. And these are three spicy fragrances that I love. And we are starting with Pure Excess from Paco Rabanne. And this is a vanilla focused, warm, spicy, sweet, woody and aromatic fragrance. This has a wonderful opening with bergamot, some grapefruit, ginger and thyme. So you have something fresh and something spicy in the opening. Then you have some sweet vanilla together with liquor, cinnamon, leather and apple. So you get something boozy together with something sweet and the beautiful spiciness from cinnamon. And in the base you have some myrrh which makes it sort of warm, balsamic, aromatic and some sugar, woody notes and cashmere. And this stays on for long. It projects good but it's not beast mode. And the boozy note in this one is so wonderful together with the spicy side and the sweet notes are just, yeah, just wrapping it up in a perfect way. This is the sweet and spicy seducer, perfect for a night out or a date. I would definitely wear it to a dinner with friends. And you can never ever go wrong with a fragrance from Paco Rabanne. So far I haven't smelled anything that disappointed me. Moving on to something fresh, sweet, aromatic and spicy with a woody side. And we are going to talk about Versace Eros Flame. This opens up really citrusy with mandarin orange, some lemon together with rosemary and black pepper. So you have the freshness from citrus together with those really great spices. Then you get the geranium that really contributes to the aromatic side and some rose. But I can't say that I can pick up that much of the rose. And in the base you have the sweet vanilla that you can recognize from the other Eros flankers. You have tonka bean, cedar and sandalwood. This is long lasting and it's strong. And I think it's a bit heavier on the citrus notes than the other Eros fragrances. So with this one, they try to make something with contrast, like being both cold and hot, sweet and spicy. And I think they made a great job. I think the original Versace Eros is amazing, but this one does have some more personality and I really like that. And now I am up for something powdery, woody, aromatic, spicy and musky. And I give to you for him Bleu Noir from Narciso Rodriguez. This has a spicy and fresh opening with cardamom, suppressed, bergamot and mandarin orange. Then you get the powdery iris, some suede and some musk and the sandalwood, the tonka bean, some leather and cedar in the base smells just amazing and incredibly elegant. So this one stays on for long and I think it projects really good because when you put this on it fills up a room but I know that some might disagree so I think you just have to try it on your skin. This is the incredibly elegant and seductive one. This stands out with that powdery cardamom and I just can't get enough of it. It is very different from everything else and it doesn't go unnoticed. I think you can wear this to almost any occasion and definitely to work if you don't go overboard with the sprays but wear it to dress up occasions and you will smell amazing. And this is one of my absolute favorite releases of 2022. Do you have a favorite spicy fragrance? Tell me in the comments, like this video and subscribe to my channel and I will see you next time. Bye.